a Carnegie Institution for Science audio press release. Wednesday, March 11, 2009. Under pressure, atoms make unlikely alloys. Ever since the Bronze Age, humans have experimented with combining different metals to create alloys with properties superior to either metal alone. But not all metals readily combine to form alloys. Most alloys are substitutional alloys. The atoms of the two metals can be randomly intermingled because they are roughly the same size and have roughly the same property called electronegativity. This means that they each attract electrons in the same way. By these rules, cerium and aluminum should not form an alloy. However, in experiments performed by Carnegie's Dave Mao and colleagues from Zhejiang University in China, at pressures 250,000 times normal air pressure, something different happens. The cerium atoms compress and shrink and lose some of their outer electrons. Their size and electronegativity become similar enough that they can form an alloy. Mao says that what's especially interesting about this alloy is that it persists even when the pressure is removed. Cerium is among the rare earth elements which are components of the strongest magnets. This means that the new alloy could also have novel electronic and mechanical properties. The research is presented in the February 24, 2009 Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences. For more information, see our website at www.ciw.edu. This is John Strom for the Carnegie Institution.